Hey, what's up? I'm Ada from DX Daily Podcast, and check this out. So Kid Cudi and Kanye West's tumultuous friendship took another turn in February when Ye called out his former protege over his friendship with Pete Davidson, who's currently dating his ex-wife, Kim Kardashian. Kanye publicly announced Cudi wouldn't be on Donda 2 and questioned his loyalty, prompting a vicious response from the Lonely Stoner. Too bad I don't want to be on your album, you effing dinosaur. He fired back. Everyone knows I've been the best thing about your album since I met you. We talked weeks ago about this. You're whack for flipping the script and posting in this lie just for a look on the internet. You ain't no friend, bye. Kanye extended an olive branch to Kid Cudi just days later, telling him, love you family, in response to a tweet from Cudi saying he could use God's help right now. However, it appears as though there's still friction between the Kid Seacoast collaborators. On Tuesday, April 19th, Kid Cudi took to Twitter to announce he won't be working with Kanye West going forward. His tweet came after the track list for Pusha T's new album is almost dry surfaced online, showing Cudi and Kanye appearing together on a song called Rock and Roll. Hey, so I know some of you heard about the song I got with Pusha. I did this song a year ago when I was still cool with Kanye. I am not cool with that man. He's not my friend, and I only cleared the song for Pusha because that's my guy. This is the last song you will hear me on with Kanye, Scott. The announcement will no doubt come as a disappointment for fans who've been waiting on new music from Kanye West and Kid Cudi. Since first linking up on Welcome to Heartbreak in 2008, the duo has formed a formidable partnership that has spawned collaborations such as Gorgeous, Erase Me, and Father Stretch My Hands Part 1. In 2018, Kanye and Cudi's chemistry culminated in the joint album Kids Seek Ghost, which debuted at number 2 on the Billboard 200 and produced the platinum certified anthem Reborn. Plans for an accompanying animated series and a sequel have been discussed but for now, it looks like neither of those will be happening. It's Almost Dry is expected to arrive on Friday, April 22nd. So how do you feel about Kid Cudi and Kanye West really being done done? Are you excited to hear what this song may sound like though with them on it? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And subscribe to the DX Daily Podcast on all streaming platforms. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.